Newton's first law states that an object in motion stays in motion while an object in rest stays at rest. Uh, inertia is an object's resistance to change. Um, so the greater the mass, the greater the inertia. An example of an object staying in motion unless acted upon by an outside force is shown through me throwing this eraser at this board. When I throw the eraser, it stays in motion until it's stopped by the impact of the board. An example of an object staying at rest is this eraser. No outside forces are acting upon it, and therefore it's staying at rest. Newton's second law states that force is calculated by mass times acceleration. So the heavy, heavier the object is and the harder you throw it means a greater force. Newton's third law states that every action is an equal and opposite reaction. This is shown if I push this eraser down the ramp, it immediately slows down because the opposite force slows it down by pushing in this direction. This eraser also doesn't slide down the ramp because of friction, because the eraser pushes a force down this down in this direction, while friction pushes it back up in this direction. And because the forces are equal, it stays still. Also because these are both uh, not perfectly smooth surfaces, so if these were bro both perfectly smooth, this would just slide right down.